Now, the crypto industry has been plagued by bad headlines for over a year. This is the reason why global regulators are eyeing the industry with distrust now. After FTX Sam Bankman freed Binance founder Chang Peng Zhao is the latest high profile name charged by regulators. Richard Teng, the new head of Binance, has a lot on his plate now. He has to claim 150 million users. He has to calm 150 million users who may be on the verge of losing their composure and appease aggressive US authorities as well. Teng also has to maintain the support of Zhao and his partner Yi He who is the co-founder. Binance will pay $4.3 billion, one of the biggest fines in US history. Zhao will pay a punishment of $50 million. A plea agreement reduced his sentence from 10 years to 18 months, but he still faces much time behind bars. Now, according to Defilama Detail, Defilama Data, the Binance platform saw net withdrawals of $1.3 billion in the last 24 hours, but that's less than $4 billion per day that was withdrawn at time of at times of crisis in the past. And only a fraction of Binance assets that are valued at $67 billion. Now, viewers, in 2017, Binance became the talk of the crypto world. Following FTX demise in November 2022, its market share skyrocketed to over 60% globally. However, researcher CC Data re reports that since then, its total market share has dropped to below 45%. Despite the euphoria surrounding expectations for exchange trade funds for Bitcoin, there are more naysayers now than before.